What's up everybody, Naresh here, welcoming you back into another video. And in today's video, I have got my hands on this Ape Man A80 Action Camera, which comes with the features like a 4K Ultra HD recording, 40 meter waterproof case, Wi-Fi control, so you can use your mobile phone to control, change all the settings and stuff like that on the go, as well as the time lapse recording. You can also use this camera as a dash cam, mode is available within the settings and i will be showing you in the video as well that how to do this all there's another important thing which i would like to point out to all of you that camera is claimed to record 4k in terms of lens wise yes it is capable but the processor which it comes with is only capable to record 2k videos now let's quickly jump into the specification as well as the key feature of this a80 action camera by appman where most of the key feature and detail specifications are mentioned on the packaging starting with the 4k ultra hd recording 40 meter deep down waterproof 180 degree wide angle and the battery capacity which is 1050 milliampere hour now here we have the specification that what video recordings can be done using this action camera as well as the photos now let's quickly jump into the unboxing and see what we have in the box now in the box we have another carrier box for your all camera equipments as well as the camera inside so here we have everything which come with this camera starting with action camera user manual customer survey notice to lithium ion 1500 milliampere hour batteries one micro usb charging cable all these different type of fittings which will help you to use this action camera on every different different application to help you that i have also put all the information on the screen you have just noticed so you can use these different different fittings to mount the camera on your bike helmet skateboard and many more places last but not least we have our a80 action camera by appman which come with this water and dust proof case you can also access all the buttons of camera even with the case on it so while you're in the water or anywhere else you can easily use this button to navigate within the menu or play and pause or take a picture if you want to on top of the case you have a latch to open up this compartment which can be done very easily simple as that now all the buttons on the camera are ergonomically designed now in the front of camera we have appman logo and a 4k notification that camera can record 4k footages right on the top of it you have a power on and off as well as a mode selection button which will help you to select the mode of video recording taking pictures or settings if you want to obviously we have a camera lens in the front as well which we should not forget about then on one of his side we have a two ports one is a micro usb for charging this camera or data transfer and the digital video output you also have a micro sd card slot next to it which is capable to go up to 128 gigabytes where on the back of camera we have a lcd display to access all the settings as well as play the playback videos and the photos if you want to then on the one of his side we have a two multifunctional button which will help you to navigate within the menu as well as to turn on your wi-fi because the camera come with the built-in wi-fi that's how you're going to connect this camera with your mobile phone now on the top of camera we have a status indicator light as well as the ok button and the battery compartment is in the base by lifting this lever up you can open it up place your lithium-ion battery inside and go ahead with the powering up sequence now press and hold this power on button you get to hear the audible notification and straight away you are on it there is a link available in the video description for all compatible cards which you can use on this camera now on the lcd screen you're going to see everything what is happening with the camera that what mode of operation it is in which is in the video and what is the battery status and sd card required or not down below you also going to see information about the exposure iso settings what format is set to record at it's which is 4k at 30 frames per second white balance is selected in auto so as a screen as scene 2 next to the lcd screen you're going to see the status indicator light if you'd like to change mode of operation of this camera 
by pressing this mode button you can do that and when mode of operation is changed you're going to see the status right on the top as well let's have a quick look within the settings which are offered by this a80 action camera within the settings you get an option for video resolution sensor size time lapse mode loop recording slow down and keep scrolling down you got so many settings all together 37 settings and i'm sure it will be very difficult to do that on your lcd screen which is on your action camera you can use the app which can be installed from google play store or from apple store and it's called u2 pro now install this u2 pro application from google play store connecting your u2 pro application with your action camera will be straightforward by press over this connect camera button now here is going to look for the wi-fi of your camera turn on wi-fi using these two multifunctional buttons by simply press on it our wi-fi will be turned on and you're going to see what is the ssid as well as the password for it now within the list locate ssid for your camera once you see it, type in the password which is seen on the screen which is by default one two three four five six seven eight once you are connected successfully on it here is your action camera with this live feed as well to access all the settings of your camera you can click on to the setting button here you're going to see all information which you have seen in the setting tab starting with the resolution what is the lens type recording mode encoding mode auto white balance exposure compensation iso stamp date and scene auto as well keep scrolling down into the device setting you're going to see more settings with respect to the screen saver on your action camera auto shut off wi-fi language auto synchronization of the time rotation of the display if you want to as well as the frequency you can also format the sd card of your camera right from your mobile phone straight away but that's not it you can use the mobile phone to record the video footage straight away by press of a one button from here or you can view what is in the sd card available on your camera within the gallery area and download it on your mobile directly now when you're not using the application make sure to turn off your wi-fi by pressing this multifunctional button it will let you save more energy let's go ahead with the demonstration and see all the videos which are recorded using this action camera as well as the pictures taken which you wanted to know about this mode is also available within the user manual so let's go for it now with the now with the help of this mode, you can actually run smoother as well. That is what I noticed, so just to mention to your audience.
this is an indoor video recording of this A80 action camera which you can see a bit of lighting going on here and there but on me there is no lighting so you can actually tell that is it looking okay -ish or not I'm sure I will be looking pretty okay to be honest with you but you will be the judge of it for sure guys now with this video recording sample you will also have an idea that how is a microphone performance in indoor outdoors when it's inside a it's watertight compartment it's a bit difficult to be honest with you but open up like this you should be able to tell the difference well here i am in the end of this video and i try to show each and everything what this a80 action camera can do for you all the video recording footages are also available for you to check out and i will be using this camera daily basis so if you have any questions please let me know now everything seems to be perfectly fine with it the output quality and the app was also fantastic actually which let me control the camera settings on the go actually that's not bad at all now in terms of showing you the all actions around it guys i'm not an action guy to be honest with you but i will try if i find any action next time i will bring it to all now in future i will be putting a lot of video reviews for action camera and also action camera gimbals too so stay tuned if you are interested in them now that will be completely all from my side guys thank you again for watching this video shall see you soon into another one bye for now